My name is Amir Adibi with the DBIP Group. We're intellectual property professionals and we can help you protect your inventions, your marks, your brand, and your creative works. Today we're going to be talking about silly patents and how you can monetize possibly pretty much any sort of invention. Let's talk about some fun, silly patents. Things that you may not think are patentable, but in fact were successfully patented. Now, what's really interesting is that there's generally three requirements to actually be able to obtain a patent. There has to be utility, there has to be novelty, and the invention has to be non-obvious. Now, we're gonna talk specifically about utility in this video because as you can see, some of the examples we'll be talking about today are very questionable in terms of their utility. What you're gonna realize is that the bar for utility is quite low. Let's talk about the life expectancy timepiece patent. So in this patent, this inventor got a patent on basically a watch. Rather than tell you the time, it tells you how much time you have left to live. So it literally is a countdown that tries to estimate how many days and hours and minutes are left in a person's life. Now, this sounds seemingly useless, but if you think about it, it uses factors such as weight and lifestyle choices. And so in a sense, the utility of this patent may be in that it helps encourage people to live healthier lifestyles because if every time they look down at their watch, they'll see how much time they have left to live. So although seemingly silly and useless, it may actually serve a useful purpose of helping people live healthier lifestyles. Some silly ideas are worth monetizing. Imagine who you license this patent to, probably a gag gift shop. Well, that lends its, itself to the question of how useful is a gag gift if it is in fact supposed to be a joke and serve no useful purpose. But again, the bar for utility is quite low. And as long as you can justify some reason for why something could be useful, it's possible to patent it. The next silly patent is the aquarium bathtub patent. So this is literally a bathtub that is surrounded by an aquarium. So the bathtub structure 